Good morning guys. Ooh, look at this now. Rain is gone. So since the rain is gone, we are traveling. Actually it was not the rain while I was not traveling. I was like I'm getting exhausted. I'm getting exhausted. It's like the second month of the travel already going on and I was going already two weeks without a break and that's hard that's really hard but anyway what are we doing today we are approaching to 5,000 kilometers on a GP PR7 this guy which one is hiding and yesterday yesterday I found a, a little uh, workshop over here which one's they're gonna say gonna look for the oil and if they have the oil I mean they're gonna go get it somewhere they said if, if there is a in a parts store there is a oil I'm changing the oil so I could change it after one more thousand kilometers but it doesn't really matter because more often it's better that's my theory I have 4875 kilometers on my motorcycle so it's about time to change well I still have 1000 kilometers to go if I have to and real quick I'm gonna say I rode this motorcycle two days ago I want to see how long I can sit on that bike so I fell up and I rode 250 kilometers something 260 kilometers on 110 kilometers 115 kilometers an hour speed and I didn't get tired so the seat is pretty comfortable I I think this maybe the handlebars is not the best position for me because uh, I, my this right hand gets a little tired but it's like always I want to go wider in a sport riding position for the motocross like this because like this it's kind of I get a little too much kink like that oh over here in Italy everything so freaking tired but we will see what is he gonna say Good morning. I wonder, did we get the oil? It's good? All right, so we changed the oil. 9.49, guys. Friday, 15th, Friday, 15th of September. Now I'm not sure how long they're gonna wait until they're gonna change the oil. But they asked me to take a long breakfast. Oh, it looks so dark. Oof. How much? 4,000 kilometers from the oil. A lot of shavings. Very a lot. Okay. Hmm. They have spear filter with me, so we will change the filter as well. So I'm going to be able to get another one spear filter in Portugal. But because of that much metal shavings, it's a little too much, strange why. And uh, we will change the oil filter as well. And this second bolt and more yes. oil coming out. So all the oil is drained perfectly. YouTube? Yes, yes. Castro Paulo Racing 1050 Ultimate Selection In Italy sometimes you put not what you want but what you have but We must not forget the mesh filter in the side Ooh, More oil Yeah, so Not crazy a lot but It's Pretty Crazy dirty. So that cost for me 70 euro. But you know, guys like you know is jumping over and did really like good job for being really nice. I left 20 euro for pizza guys for the lunch. And it's 11.40. So how much am I gonna be able to drive today? I don't freaking know. I wonder how it's gonna be in the mountain because over here the weather is so perfect but look at the top of the mountains 
It's pretty thick clouds over there. That's a paid road. So it looks like we are going with this autobahn together. It used to be probably the old old road over here and then they build the autobahn. It's not an autobahn, it's a triad or whatever it's called, I don't know. But the paid highway. And we just go underneath it or oh, everywhere. Really cool. You gotta go slow with this, otherwise it splashes. So a little inconvenient because you gotta go slow, but you know what? Is that gonna ruin your life if you're gonna spend extra 30 seconds over here? And one more thing, you cannot fill completely up to the top. If you will fill up to the top, then it starts draining in the bottom. It's a little bit... the tank cover is a little bit pain in the butt. But you know, you learn once and then you know how to do it. I might try to measure how many kilometers I can go, or how, how many liters it uses per 100 kilometers. 49, 13. 49, 13 so i'll have that in the video and we will calculate when i will fill up next time if i will not forget and i have 138 kilometers of this dead left and now guys we're going in proper dead on that river crossing success big river crossing no oh, it's a little deeper success <laughs> and we'll wash it in the river yeah but well, that's a proper tip. Look at this little deer. Oh my god, it's a baby one. <laughs> this is proper off road going on over here. going with the bicycles and I'm crying that I'm going with my motorcycle. <laughs> I used to be some big nice houses over here, huh? Nothing left anymore. Nothing left. Oh but this road is <laughs> a jumpy one. Beats me up from the very beginning, but that's good. Because it's better go this way than, you know, this paid road I took 400 kilometers. That was really, really boring. Found a dead rider who lost his motorcycle. But he has his sticks. And I see he like, oh, wake like this up. Oh. Guys, <laughs> I didn't film that because there was no time to turn on the camera, but now I'm going through road like this, roads, if I wouldn't do Hungary before and stuff like that, I wouldn't be trying here. And now I just go, you know, because I know that my motorcycle can handle this stuff. Oof, look at this. And this uphill and stony. No, I'm proud of myself. How am I going with this bike over here? Oof. And you look in this. I'm literally riding on the stones. 
and I'm trying to stand up but it's uh, when it's steep you're still hanging on your hands oh now I need water and we're gonna go find the Corsi Colle de Malogno gonna go ask these guys maybe they need help I see they're fixing the bike because I have some tools you guys okay? okay <laughs> they are good so Oh, and they're building new ones. Ah, that's cool, huh? Pretty awesome spot, guys, huh? <laughs> but to get here, ooh, the road is tough. But you know what? I like my confidence now. I see this all this road. Just put acceleration and just go up. The bike is really... It goes like a tank, like a tractor everywhere. But like, I thought I was gonna make some cool picture. I did make one. You will see the thumbnail. It's a little windy every other. A little windy, but people working over there, so I don't want to disturb them. We can get the wings if we want to for our motorcycle. They might be a little too big. <laughs> to go there okay it's just open aperta it's, it's not here over here there's somebody what the heck do you want me to do second gear guys not the third gear there's one more road okay let's check that out because obviously I missed even more okay that's where I have to go Oh my god, really? <laughs> oh well. I have way too easy. I hope that's correct one, otherwise <laughs> I might not might not find the way out of there. Okay, they say Stand up. Stand up where? Okay. Uh. Yep. Stand up here. Uh. And I know I need to go be a be as back as possible on my bike. It's only one thing I have. Ah, that's cool. <laughs> Look at this. I have my back on my bag. On my back. Oh, I should have to go there. You know you come from the corner and you found like this and you don't know what to do how to ride it because you don't know where is the canals from the water over oh, here it's oh oh 
I have to go there. You see? Oh, and I don't want to go too much forward over there. I definitely cannot turn off the camera because of this new road. Oh my god. Guys, I don't want to fall here. That would be ouchy. Oh. So let's go look what kind of run now we have. That's it steep. Just look, I moved a little bit and the bike is already so below. But, okay. That's what kind of road we have. Over here. As big as my palm. All of it like this. So, some stony road, but it's okay, it's not very steep, it's, uh, but the only thing is it was raining, so this gravel is so good. So, definitely gonna have some fun on it. Yeah, guys. When I was going that in Finland and Sweden, I didn't think that uh, that in Western countries gonna be like this. So I was like, yeah, no problem. One month I'm in Portugal, yeah, Portugal, Portugal. I'm one month and I'm in Portugal. Now when I get the roads like this, I different <sighs> like you see this road is not a joke guys it's a proper that road <sighs> and my rear tire is spinning like riding a uh, bottom of the river all those stones are washed out oh my god I'm so happy I'm with the light bike they're coming and jumping over here Your bike is jumping everywhere. Uh, you just this is like uh, for dirt bikes. I probably could have asked it. <laughs> Italian guys, can I go here? I know I need to stand up, but my hands is not holding anymore, guys. Uh, 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 but I will. Because otherwise I won't be able to go over here. Oh my god. Oh. So all this part is going to be of this one road. But that's, I have 114 kilometers to go, guys. We're getting there. No worries. Cantiria Forestale. I hope I'm not getting excavator again. Because the most was not written that there is a road forbidden. But I can tell that there is forest work. 
you see. But this time they didn't go with the road. I took a wrong turn. It looked like this one, but it wasn't. And you know what? That one, which one I didn't, didn't take, looked very stony. Even this one is not the best. Look at that. That's where I have to go. You see how big the stones are over there? What the heck, guys? You really... The Italians gave me some jokes over here, you see? Imagine how big they are. I'll just get one for you. Look what stones are over here. And it's not even taking the biggest one. Look, all of them like this. And it's the same all the way up. You sure that's what I'm supposed to do? Ooh. Yeah, I'm sure. The line doesn't lie. The line doesn't lie. That's gonna be always like this. All 100 kilometers. Yeah, baby, I'll light my fire. <laughs> I'm a little bit intimidated to start riding it. I want to go on one wheel. Oh, guys. Oh, a little jumped. Oof. Barely managed it. It just wants to go on one wheel. That's the problem. I should sit down more in the front. But look at these boulders. God, guys, there is something. Oh. I'm so happy I did this days off, this day off because, man, oh man, I don't know how to show you, but look, that's where I'm standing right now. You see, and all these stones over here. That's where I'm driving on. And you go, you go, you go. It's all the same, all the same. See? Yeah, and then it goes like this further away. I'm pretty high up over here. Pretty high up. But I think, you know, going up this, these roads, I think going up these roads is a little better than going down. Because I'm going, if you go, I would go down on these, no, I would roll with these big long stones. And now I just go up. <laughs> Woo, it's fun. But I gotta go because 105 kilometers still. I was showing 104, now it's 105. Am I going wrong way? No, I'm, I'm going correct way. I'm going correct way, you see. And it's gonna be lots of lots of interesting roads. the road for freaking hard and raw. Oh shit, this wants to go on one wheel again. Hey, look at this. 
Really? Why am I going here? Why? Oh my goodness. Ah, still so much left up there. Ah. I'm telling you one thing. I'm looking at it right now and it's intimidating. It's intimidating. I just am afraid to go there. Ah. But if I don't go, who will? smaller stones and then go, you know? Oof. Oh my god. Oof. This is the road for freaking hard and the road. Oh shit, this wants to go on one wheel again. Hey, look at this. Really? Why am I going here? Why? Oh my goodness, ah, still so much left up there. Ah. I'm telling you one thing, I'm looking at it right now and it's intimidating. It's intimidating, I just am afraid to go there. Ah. But if I don't go, who will? smaller stones and then go, you know? Oof. Oh my god. Oh, it's a little better. Oof. Not so many loose stones, you know, when you go down. Ah, shut off the engine, guys. I'll go with a short engine. Okay, there is a stone over here. <laughs> I'm stuck up there. Okay. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. <sighs> there is some, there is some fun part. You know, when the wheel starts sliding, it's slide sideways. Yeah, well. Somewhere here. That's where we have to go. You see? Oh my god, look at this sharp sharp stones over there. That's where we want to go. It's not like where we want to go, but where we have to go. Now we need to go all these serpentines. <laughs> Looks like my fun part end and go to even more fun part. Oh, oh wow, that's deep. And it's little less taken care of. Wow! <laughs> picture, picture, picture. Okay. Let's go, baby. Oh, Something is wrong.
Okay, guys, we have a problem. You see? It's leaking through the... It's not, it's not tight enough, it's bolt. Ah! I have enough oil though. That's good. And it's dripping from this one. Oh, it's completely loose. What the heck? My friend, what the heck did you did you do? It's completely loose. Look at this. It's a little hot. I hope I have had it. Okay, that should be good now. Yeah, so the oil was good. Shoot. That wasn't a good experience. Wow, but it was so loose. If I would have lost it, it would be a big, big problem. Wow. What a beautiful spot to fix the bike, yeah? <laughs> a little windy. But you tell me guys, how close from disaster was I? <sighs> Imagine this one would have fall and I would have wouldn't see it. <sighs> it's good if the red light would come real, real quick but and I would stop, but I could have been I mean, in the middle of nowhere. <sighs> About 200 meters away, <laughs> I'm in my, I'm with my love again. Hello. Hey, hello. No, no. Oh, just uh, is, uh, is forbidden go with the uh, motor or auto on the field. Uh, on oh, on the field. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, no problem. Yeah, yeah, but okay, then I know now. Yeah. Because well, I came over here just well, to see well, the picture. Where are you going? To Portugal. To Portugal. Whoa, what the <laughs> oh, fuck, mate. It's nice. <laughs> Ah, yeah, you must follow the Alta Via, but I think you know what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have the, I have the, the track and everything. Just, but I saw you guys stopped over here. I wanted to see what the heck you doing, guys. Yeah. You uh, going down here? We do a nice trail uh, no, oh. with the bikes. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, guys. <laughs> Take care. <laughs> oh, but it's what a beautiful view. Look, and those guys just going down. Oh my God, they're crazy. They're crazy. It's windy. Only I wish we wouldn't go towards the the rain. But looks like we are. As you see, I'm riding without helmet because I was transferred, somebody transferred, somebody you know transferred money for me and told me go and sleep in a hotel tonight. So and it's five o'clock already. I found a hotel for myself. It's actually right there. We have shower. Awesome. That's pretty cool. Six sixty-six from there. But you know, like I had to change oil and everything. That took a lot of time. So, but I did about hundred, hundred fifty, hundred thirty. Not much. Hope better day tomorrow.